Good morrow, gentle <laughs> mistress. Where away? Tell me, sweet Kate, and tell me truly, too, hast thou beheld a fresher gentle woman? Such war of white and red within her cheeks? What stars do spangle heaven with such beauty as those two eyes become that heavenly face? Fair lovely maid, once more good day to thee. Sweet Kate, embrace her for her beauty's sake. Young budding virgin, fair and fresh and sweet, whither away or where is thy abode? Happy the parents of so fair a child, happier the man whom favorable stars allot thee for his lovely bedfellow. Why, how now, Kate, I hope thou art not mad. This is a man, <sighs> old, wrinkled, faded, <laughs> withered, and not a maiden, as thou sayst he is. A pardon. Old father, <laughs> my mistaking eyes that have been so bedazzled with the sun that everything I look on seemeth green. Now I perceive thou art a reverend father. Pardon, I pray thee, for my mad mistaking. Do, good old grandsire, and withal make known which way thou travelest. If along with us we shall be joyful of thy company. Fair sir, and you my merry mistress that with your strange encounter much amazed me. My name is called Vincentio, my dwelling Pisa, and bound I am to Padua, there to visit a son of mine, which long I have not seen. What is his name? Oh, Lucentio, gentle sir. 